Hey guys, what's up? We are back and we are continuing with this world record attempt here. Uh, very, I've mixed up my strategy. Uh, as you can see, I still have the time bomb down on round one. Still looking for your guys' opinion on whether I should finish the round or time bomb it out back to one again. I'm not really pushed. A uh, few of you guys wanted to see my kills and downs. And how long do the rounds take? Uh, like I said, I've switched up. I'm going for this resonator strategy. With the resonator up above the jug. And it's pretty much the same, whether or not, to the trample steam strategy I used to use. I think it may be a little bit quicker. A bit safer, I'm, I'm a little bit in between. But well, here we are, as we usually do start up, refresh with the uh, brand new traps. Of course, I think that resonator is probably a bit too far back, so I'll swap it for the turbine and get ready to go. Now, I'll just slow these zombies down a bit, let the trap of steam and the head chopper chop away, man. Look that head chopper, man, it's epic. <laughs> That that thing I just had chopping off heads. I love it. So then we switch up back to this resonator. All the stuff starts to destroy. You notice this head chopper can stay there for a hell of a lot longer. I don't know, it's just the number of zombies you can kill, I'm not sure. But this resonator definitely takes out the punches. Now, I'm not sure about it. Pulse wires, zombie wires, how long it does it last? It seems to be pretty erratic. So it seems to be anywhere from 9 to 15 pulses per resonate on a fresh turbine before it'll uh, destroy. Good 20 to 40 seconds. Uh, what I've noticed as well, you'll get 3, maybe 4 resonators from one turbine before it starts to uh, freeze out on you and stop on you and basically just slow you down so what I've done is uh, basically after that third or fourth as soon as your travel steam stops out uh, oh, not your travel steam excuse me your turbine as soon as that stops you've got it pick it up, get rid of it, grab a new one. Because uh, the time wasted and trying to kill these guys with this petrifier. Even though it does kill them it just takes too long when you're going for these high rounds, you just wanna pound through the rounds as quick as possible. So your Xbox doesn't freeze or you don't get lagged out. That's what happened to you last time and as you seen in my last video as you guys are keeping tabs I got to round 93 and uh, this new update was after coming out which was supposed to fix a lot of glitches in Buried and some other things that people are having issues with I believe uh, you couldn't carry monkey bombs and, <coughs> and the time bomb at the same time apparently that's been fixed but the big down is that I was actually on round 93 when that happened and it's just Jack me from the game. Um, I have to basically restart. So here we are, we restart. Get rid of this turbine. I know the zombies are gonna kill it, but I've had a few <laughs> turbines planted there, and a whole mob of zombies just ran right past it. Got to uh, grab a new turbine, as if you've already got one. So you know, you've got to be kidding me. So we just do a quick lap around. New turbine, old resonator, so count that as one, probably only last a pulse or two. And then we go grab another one. And it's basically just four of these resonators per turbine. And you're pretty much golden, man, nothing can get near you. And you can easily tell when the round is about to end. As you just you don't get as many zombies coming down, but you get three, four, 
fire pulses with like one zombie around the edge and you know that's the end and it's up to yourself whether you wanna just keep on going, let them walk in, bum away or if you like to do what I do and uh, reset new traps. We just had a quick look at the kills and the downs. 2400, zero downs. Uh, I actually have a little cock up. Or should I say, something interesting happens through the beauty of editing. And, uh, wonder if any of you guys will be able to spot it. I'm sure you will. A lot of smart guys out there. That will spot what happens. But I won't leave you in suspense <coughs> at the end of the video. We'll uh, see what happened. I think we're coming to the end of this round here anyway. About 6 minutes. Yeah, I think we're at 6.20 now. Around 6.69. We've got one, maybe two zombies. I don't know, get a new turbine, seeing how we're using the resonator strategy. Got a new resonator. Give that to this guy as well, let me smash that. <clears throat> that was it. Through the beauty of editing, I'll go over grab a new turbine. And maybe come back. We've got a full set of fresh traps again. So now let's go kill this last zombie and move on to round 70. I kill that last guy. And uh, round 70. No wonder if anybody cop what just happened. Yes, no. Feel free, spin the video back. 25, 30 seconds. Have a quick look, see if anything changed. Because, uh, noob noob on the part of myself. You can see it coming up soon enough. Let me just plug away here. Round 70. Now we still have this game going at the moment, I think I'm on 75, 76, somewhere in around there. That's it. It's on pause now, so I can't really see the number. But I'm pause it. I'm doing this. But I do believe I get the kill count up here. And quick flash there. Any of you guys notice anything? Alright. You probably noticed already. Have a look at my perks. I believe Quick Revive was the fifth perk. And now it's the last perk. <laughs> I couldn't believe I've done this, man. I really don't believe it. On the very last zombie on round 69. Guess what happened? Huh? We got one down and one avoid. And nilb nilb. Straight up nilb nilb. I had lost my PhD. And I put myself down with most things. Look at this, look. <laughs> can, you, can you believe that, man? Can you believe that one zombie pull out Mustang and Sally? No pen with PhD. Boom. <laughs> what a new move. One goddamn zombie. Yep. You can do this. Round 90, round 95, it doesn't matter. As long as it's five rounds apart. Now I've only been down to once. I've got four perks. I cannot. Boy, quick revive. 
even though it's there. But we go into the house. Lights are on. She's home. She's gonna give me a free perk. As I've got six perks. With my permit tombstone when I come back up. I can uh, get a free quick revive from uh, the witches. Now this is 69 count for my next perk if I was to go down I'd have to wait until 74 before I can get a free quick revive. But as long as you survive 5 rounds you're grand. This is the spot I like here. You can see both exits to the house. Any witches come. I'm expecting more but that's it. It's just the one. And I don't know if you can get or do it more than once but I still haven't used the ballistic knife to tip the girl on, or the witch on the piano. And that's always another quick revive that you